I'm Sha from Charlie's Angel Tarot and if you're new welcome to the channel and if you are one of my uh, cyber angels welcome to the channel as well and please enjoy what you see and please subscribe and hit the bell on all then you'll be notified when new videos are loaded up and when I go live I go live on Monday Wednesday and Friday and I give away free cards and I answer questions that are supported by Super Chats. You, um, this, these are the cards for the 7th of July. It is 7-7, seven, seven, so the angels are here with us. And I can also see that back in the cards because the cards are a very, very um, positive today. We've got the King of Pentacles and he's got the Meter's Touch. This could be your number one card, two, three, or morning, afternoon, and evening, or all three together. So take the card that speaks to you the most. I'll start off with the King of Pentacles. Everything he touches turns to gold. In other words, everything you do today will turn out positively and will have a positive result. You might also be meeting a King of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles is Taurus, but don't exclude Virgo or Capricorn. So they're uh, lovely people, they're very stable, they stand for durability and long term. So if it is a friendship that you want with one of these people, it uh, is for a long, long time. They are uh, slow in um, letting opening and they're slow in opening up because they really want to make sure that their friends are true friends and that's the positive thing about them okay and they are very uh, steady because they're with both feet on the ground they're earth people okay uh, pentacles are earth people so they are very stable people well we all are but that's the one side of the pentacles, okay? They they have both feet on the ground, as you can see. The king has his feet on the ground as well. He's not cross-legged either. So he, that shows firmness, steadiness. Okay, and um, in the afternoon we have the ace of cups. So you might be even starting something new that you're passionate about or that you love or that you can nurture or sensuality and sexuality, emotions, perhaps spiritual. You might be very sensitive this afternoon. You might be emotionally more sensitive in the afternoon than in the morning. In the morning you might be more businesslike. You might be um, steadfast, more masculine, perhaps your masculinity might come out more in the morning than in the afternoon. Perhaps you are more nurturing, more like the feminine side, like a mother. Perhaps you are nurturing something, a new project, or a new job, a new hobby. Perhaps you, you might find out that somebody is pregnant or having a baby or a birth and it could be a birth of a cancer wow and it is seven seven remember so luck is on your side perhaps you'll be emotionally aesthetically happy because it's seven seven and that means luck and of course business is going well so perhaps this is something new that you're going to start a business or like I said a hobby or a relationship because the cups also stand for love and passion perhaps you might meet a cancer a Scorpio or a Pisces so that's two dominating factors in this the earth and emotions water the water people are also uh, more sensitive or highly sensitive um, than other signs. There are a lot of people that listen to their intuition and to what their heart is saying rather than their mind. So perhaps this is a message to um, stay with both feet on the ground and listen to your heart 
but make sure that whatever you do, even if you're doing business or starting a new relationship or a new job, make sure that you remain with both feet on the ground and you are allowed to be happy and laugh of course, but don't let your head rule your heart so that you can build a steady something, a job, a relationship or whatever. And we've got the Empress and I was just talking about finding out about birth, love and passion perhaps you might res um, find out about a birth like I said and it could be a cancer because we are in cancer and the Empress um, represents Libra but she also represents Mother Earth look at that big tummy that's carrying a child she stands for fertility so if you want to get pregnant today then today is a fertile ground fertile time that could be a birth of a job or a child something new okay um, also you might be more nurturing and it, I think at the end of the day um, during the afternoon and the end of the day uh, and evening you might be more nurturing or nurturing something specific and uh, that makes it grow and like an investment you will nurture this and it will grow and it will blossom so long you love it and nurture it Woo, nice one be creative about it you've got number three so you've got definitely a new beginning and uh, the uh, number wise and also meaning of the card wise or some of you might be doing business with a Libra and this could be with the King of Pentacles Taurus Libra so Taurus you might do business with a Libra or match up with a Libra so it could be a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn that you might be meeting if this is not your yourself or you could be meeting a Cancer a Scorpio or a Pisces Okay. If also if it isn't yourself. Okay. And here we've got the Libra. So it's a very exciting day. So all in all the general message is if you take all three cards there will be something new started today whether it's a hobby or business or an investment and it will bring its return back again and again and again. It could be like a new job, so every week or every month you have your salary. That will return so long you stay in this job. For example, if you've invested in, let's say, um, a business, it will have its returns. Good on you. Well, I hope it is a good investment. Make sure that before you sign contracts, you look at the small print but I think it's a good date it is 7-7 seven, seven. although we are in mercury retrograde um, I think it, if you check everything out and you take it steady and slowly like the king of, of uh, pentacles it will be alright because we are nearing the end of the retrograde um, as the retrograde will be over by Sunday so um, if you can postpone it, the investment, then do so. If you can't, then make sure you check and check again. I hope you have enjoyed this reading for today and um, there will be a new one tomorrow and I'll be uh, going, uh, what is it today? Tuesday. I'll be going live tomorrow around quarter past eight, half past eight. So I hope to see you then. Take care and have a beautiful day and don't forget please share and like and give us the thumbs up I do appreciate it thank you very much it keeps the alpha rhythm uh, going uh, it will connect you much quicker with me or the channel um, so when I do go out and I put out notifications on Instagram Facebook and the community tab on YouTube 
so if you're not getting notified by YouTube then you'll be notified by the other media I'll see you tomorrow enjoy your day today and take care God bless and stay safe